Welcome back to Metroid Prime 2. No, Dark Torvis Bog. Yeah. Blech. Well, thankfully, we're going to be finishing up the Dark Torvis Bog today. Nice! We're going to be completely finishing it. Maybe this isn't quite a great uh, planning part on my end, why it's so long, but we got, we got some bosses here. Bosses that take a long time. Arduous bosses that need a lot of time and they, well, they've got a bone to pick with you yeah nothing is as bad as the alpha blog but these are still not nice it's gonna get a lot of really hard bosses because hey the game's getting harder i'm down for that also we're in the dark world which doesn't help at all no no but every time we beat a boss good things happen afterwards so we get one step closer to dominance over these ing yeah we're still pretty dominant i think we're good on beams, good on missiles, everything's all good. And here's our first contender! There he is! Ew. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like a Grenchler, doesn't he? The Grapple Guardian? The Grapple Guardian! What? Yep. The Grapple Guardian. Big tongue. <laughs> so he's weak in the back, but also... You, the way I do this is you shoot him in the mouth a whole bunch. Okay. This kind of annoys ah, him. Ah, okay. This kind of annoys him, and then he uh, unleashes his grapple beam there. Oh, to... And from there, you can kind of get behind him from there. It's... This is just a... Just a... In theory kind of thing. It's, it's supposed to work in practice. Sometimes you can get him to grab onto these things here. Oh, and that okay. stuns him, and you can get around him, but the thing is, he turns around too fast. It's... Hmm. You really gotta get him to work with you. Well, it, I don't think that is in his repertoire. He's looking down at his list of friends and going, Hmm, Samus, you're not on my top five. Super Missile works pretty good here, but again, it's just finding the right time to get behind him. There he goes. Looks like he got shocked or whatever. I find it's like... Oh, oh. It's really hard. I see what you're meaning. Okay. Little bit of arduousness. If you get a, a good super missile, it'll take like a whole shit ton of his health. Oh, nice. He's still weak in the mouth, but he's more weaker in the back, like there. Yeah. Nice. That was a good super missile hit. Okay. Like he needs to be uh, like the proper distance away from one of those uh, those pillars in order to be caught by it. Is he weak to anything specific? Like weak to light beam, dark beam, anything like that? Uh, light beam's pretty good, but I kind of want to save some of my beam. Gotcha, gotcha. If he grabs you, it's not the end of the world. <laughs> he just really wants to bring you over here. There we go, not a good one. Dance the tango with you. Ow. Yeah, he's got to dance the tango, but, you know... What's, what's interesting is that we're not really uh, focusing on staying inside the beacon too long. Yeah, I noticed. You kind of just... Playing it, haphazardly. Ow. That took a whole E-tank. Yeah. He, he hurts when he bites you. Ow. Which leads me to an idea. What if I let him grab me? Yeah, what happens then? I let him grab me and I shoot him in the mouth a whole bunch. What would that do? Would it stun him long enough? Oh, that's a good like stun. Like, are they pulling a, pulling a dread or you, you whiffed it? Yeah. I'm sorry. It didn't, it didn't work out. I'm so sorry. Because I still stay locked onto his head. Hmm. But he's not turning red like when you do normal damage. No. Oh, oh, hello, hello, hi. So that's why I'm thinking maybe I gotta, like, shoot him in the face a whole bunch and... That, that just hurts you. That like, stuns him. So what? That stuns him, so maybe I can get a chance to... Oh. All right, let's, let's try that again. Okay. Maybe there is a benefit to having him grab onto you. All right, come here. Come here, come here, come here. Yeah, I got yeah, you. Bring, bring me over, yeah. bring me over. There, shoot him a whole bunch of missiles. So he takes some time. And then, there, that's... Okay, that's how you do it. All right, now we can spank him. Oh, okay. I still like the idea of not taking damage, but... Eh, if, if you're okay with tanking it. You gotta spend some money to make some money. You gotta, you gotta take some damage to, I, to I, deliver I some guess. damage. Bring me over, big boy! Nice. Hey, you have a reason to use all those fancy missiles you got there. Fuck! Fuck! Damn it! God! <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Imagine accidentally turning into a super missile right into your face. Hey, excuse me, madam. Would you please not shoot by... Ah! There. Okay. And oh, he's, he's in the worst place to be! Fuck! Oh, all right. Ta tail whip. 
You got you, you gotta get out here in the open, man. Get out here in the open. This way. Come here, big boy. Come over here. Okay. Alright. Now get annoyed. Don't face the, the fucking wall. Come on. There you go. Alright. Now eat me. <laughs> Maybe over here. Me Stop facing the wall. Uh, uh. There we go. I gotta be enough. Oh, I don't think I can do it. Nope. Nope. Shit. Ah. Oh, plink. Oh, this guy's annoying. Meanwhile, a bunch of people over in Jurassic Park are going, hmm, spare no expense. Or Dark <laughs> Jurassic Park, excuse me. Dark Jurassic Park? Yeah. <laughs> Jurassic World, I should say. Oh, I okay. Think, I Come think on. Get our own Come on. Here. Come on. Boom. Ah. Oh! Oh, his you tail's off, though! You blew his tail off! Alright, that means that he is way more powerful and way more angry and way quicker, but that means that he can take damage anywhere now. How does that work? Like, how does he become more powerful if you take the limb off? Because he's in a frenzy. Light wow. beam works great. Oh my god! Yeah, right okay. In the, right in the mouth. You don't have uh, these uh, pillars anymore Ooh, to help you either. I like how the boss fight changes the further along you go. Come on, come on. It, yeah, it just looks like you're not doing anything. There oh, there we, we go. go, there we All go. Right. You ain't nothing. Just had to hit him in the right spot. Some of these hitboxes going to be pretty jank. <laughs> Holding your broken arm. You ain't nothing. <coughs> I think that was my teeth. Ew. Well, what do you think this possibly is? Finally, we got the light super missiles. The light super missiles, that's right. Where'd, the, where'd my stuff go? Did I already get them? I think I did. <laughs> I, thought missiles? You were, oh. I thought you were like holding up your arms going, Are you not detained? But no, it's the grapple beam! It is the grapple beam! Kind of like an actual, like, attachment now. Very cool. <laughs> she actually looks kind of pissed off, like, oh, the grapple beam, really? That actually looks awesome! I know! Okay. So many cool things that, in this that game! That looks cool. Hold L. Okay. Works about the same way. Is it... Did it get better from Metroid Prime 1? Mm, yeah, it's still the grapple beam. Gotcha. Okay. But I think the, uh... How they set things up is a little better. So there's our first grapple grapple point up there. We'll get a scan for. Scanning grapple points. Wow. So this is essentially how we're gonna get the last key. That's what we needed to get the last key. Awesome. After all. So stuff like that. There you go. And I kind of awkwardly twirl yeah, yeah, around yeah, because this I went this the still wrong seems way. Really awkward. It's a little awkward, but uh, it's more for clearing Whee! gaps rather than doing complicated platforming sections, so far at least. So far. Uh-oh. But so- well, I don't know, it could get worse. <laughs> yeah. we're, we're getting into uncharted territory here, after all. Oh, I love it. I love that you haven't finished this, like, in your own time. You've done Prime 1, you've done Prime 3, but never Prime 2. I never finished Prime 1. What? That was- yeah, that was, uh, fresh. Oh, shoot. That was fresh too after a certain so point. So Prime 3 was the only one you finished the entire way? Uh-huh. Well, cool. <laughs> that, means it's the, that means it's the best one. Uh, I was about to say, yeah, Prime 3 is going to be your best one. See, I got to think of Metroid Prime 1 was basically them making a brand new genre of Metroid game. They didn't really have a lot to go on. Mm -hmm. Metroid Prime 2 is a refinement of that idea, and Metroid Prime 3 is the full realization of that idea. Oh, I'm, I'm trying to... Yeah, th there was some knowledge that I recently uh, came into. I was watching a did you know gaming episode and uh, Nintendo didn't expect Metroid Prime to basically unleash the love for Metroid again if you make it they will come yeah and also the best selling Metroid game before Dread came out was Metroid Fusion people dusted off their Wii U's to buy Metroid Fusion mm -hmm. Fusion's really good people like the oh, I love Fusion. people like the horror aspect obviously and then Dread comes out it it absolutely smashes records because it's the first Metroid game in fucking years. Uh, where we need to go? Oh, can use this. Whee. See, I'm wondering if Lightning can strike Ooh. twice. Like, Prime 4 comes out, will it be the best-selling Metroid Prime game? Most likely, because it barely has any competition. Oh yeah, I mean, Doom's kind of done. That came out some years ago. Halo is... <laughs> well, people are hungry for Metroid Prime 4, too. Well, yeah, I'm also meaning, like within the Metroid Prime universe. Like, 3 sold... Did 3 sell pretty good as a Wii launch title? What'd you say? It did fine. It did I mean, fine? It okay. wasn't a launch title, though. Oh, that's right. It came out slightly after launch. 07? 
Yeah, 07. 07. As you can see, we can get up here now thanks to the gravity boost. Beautiful. No oh my god, we can move through the water, dude. Yep, but now we don't need to be here anymore. Uh, oh. Because now it's time to hop into another portal and get to the Dark Temple and clear this area. Oh, that feels good. I love clearing things out. Let's go! But not without getting a few expansions first. Oh, that's worth it. I thought you had one caveat that just was not going to sound fun at all. I mean, there's there's a couple of missile... Exp uh, yeah, there are three missile expansions that we can get before we uh, get to where we need to go. On the way, or uh, going out of our way? Actually, in this area. Perfect. Right, right here in the outside of the temple in the in the the, the light Torvus bog. Yes. Oh my god, I I kind of wish we could restructure the Torvus bog and make it not so much boggy. It just looks so depressing whenever we come through here. Yeah, I know. So we start by going through X. Oh wait. Uh, Hello. I went a little too early in my in my notes here. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, uh, we'll get them. We'll get this one first. Why not? Yeah, let's just just grapple beam and yeah, oh, there you go. Oh, that one was too easy. Yeah, Come on. Yeah, that's fine. Give me something challenging here. Uh, another one is at the place with the splorb, so we'll head back there. Yeah, yeah, that room. <laughs> so we'll head back there, and uh, there's uh, one minor thing I forgot to mention. <laughs> what now? Force encounters. Uh, oh. Between dark pirate commandos. Aw, oh, did they shut everything down? They Ow. lock Ow. the doors, and we are severely under-equipped to deal with them right now! Oh, you guys have ruined everything! Oh god, this is why this episode's so long, because you guys showed up! Oh jeez. Is, uh, is it always in this in this room it's, that they it's show up? It's kind of random when they show up, but this is where they like to attack you, and oh, we are- we can't- I don't have time to deal with you guys! Leave me alone! Have fun. You take too many fucking light beam missiles and just, just, just get out of here! It's gonna get be out of here! I'm glad this exists. So Jeez! Yeah. I kill them all, my dude. You can do it. Press the X button out of that of just you know, frustration. And wh where are they? By the time I find them and shoot them, they they're already gone. That didn't hit. Are you kidding me? I hate these guys. You guys suck. Yeah, tell it to their face. I will! Right when here. they show up! Yeah, yeah, right here, right here. Where are they at? Where are you at? Get over here! Ugh. Can't see you guys! <laughs> they see you have a, they see you have a charge shot and they're just like, I don't know if I wanna go down there, dude. John, did that hit? I don't think it did. It looked like it didn't. Why didn't it? What the they, they're gone. They what? fucked off. Well good! <laughs> and, and yeah, you better run! <sighs> hey, wait. What happened to Fred? Well, as I contemplate whether I should scrap this recording or not, uh, -oh. uh well, I guess we'll keep going and we'll get the next <laughs> missile expansion, and this is the one I'm supposed to get first. <laughs> oh, the contemplation. So, there's a Woo! grapple point up there. Hop on over here. And... There's that splore bed. Okay. Yeah. Do that, and there's the second of three that we're getting. What's up, missile tank? There's one more right by the entrance to the, to the lagoon. Goo lagoon. The stinkiest place in all of Bikini Bottom. Well, this is the stinkiest place in Torvus right now, I can tell you that much. Ugh. Gross. It smells, oh, just, just it smells like death and stagnant water. Yeah, Ugh. just imagine taking off the helmet and it's just like like opening up a fresh durian. <laughs> can I smell your helmet, Samus? <laughs> <laughs> no, no, tr trust me, it, it doesn't have to do with the air filtration system can you I, have in there. Can I lick your forehead? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Reddit strikes again. Can I smell your hair? Can I please, can I please <laughs> just suck on your helmet? Just that little bit at the front, please. I want it. Just one photo of your butt, please. <laughs> oh, come on, that's being a little too forward. I, oh, okay. You gotta do it like a creep. Oh, oh my god, what's that over there? Click, click. All right, cool, we're out of here, boys. What'd you get? I got the armor, dude. Look at the picture of the armor. Probably, these guys are probably easier in the water now. We got the gravity boost, but uh, you know I don't mind uh, using the charged dark beam to oh my God, they're so take out screwed. these guys. Yeah. They're so screwed. Yeah, yeah, oh my God. Yeah, 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 but they're still not dead though. What? That, that guy's dead. Okay, that one is is very dead. Because I think, oh, I blew off their shell. That means they're dead. Well, not quite. Double tap. You can't get my juicy butt. Ah! There's a missile expansion in this room. Ah! Did you know? Uh, I I did not. Please explain more. It's down here. Oh. We couldn't get it without the gravity boost, though. Right, this one. 
Yoink! Okay. Now we're ready. For adventure? We're ready to take on the Dark Temple. Yes! The third key is right outside, so... That's, oh, that's, that's on the way. I'm gonna take a save real quick. <laughs> Grapple, Grapple Guardian gave me a little bit of a... Safety, A li li little bit of safety, a hectic. Safety, no, we, don't have to, we don't have to save, just, you know... Pop up at the at the save room to safety get our energy back. Heal. Yeah, safety heal. That's what that is. We're gonna need it. This is another one of those infamous bosses. He, th there's a lot of these bosses in another here boss. where you you either got you know it, it, it's either trivial or it's one of the hardest things. And I'm assuming this one is very trivial. You seem very confident in yourself. Well. I know you're trying to gauge how this is going to go based on my reactions, but it's, it's just going to be a boss fight. I'm just, going to, I'm just going to let it play out as is, and I'll let you know uh, how we do. If, if spanked, look for smiling face. If anything else, look for mildly disturbed face. Well, we got to get there first, so that's one thing at a time. Uh, this one's the best portal to get to, I find. It's just this one right here. Yeah. Have you actually seen some of the speedrun tactics that were used in the last run? Not Last, really. Uh, run? No, I was too busy looking at both the Metroid Prime and the Prime 2, so I didn't really... Wow! They're all complete the sequence breaking! It's all randomized! I don't get any of it! So, there is apparently something you can do in Metroid Prime 2. I assume they were playing the first version, where you can actually make it so that water does not have physics, and you can run around normally as if the water wasn't there. Sounds like a glitch, yeah. Oh, yeah. And... The, uh, that just seems to happen with a lot of games, now that I think about it. Like, you can get rid of the physics of water, so they are two separate entities, and that's just kind of neat. Gee, when people play the game a whole bunch and uh, find different tactics to go faster, you know, they probably find this stuff. That's why I loved playing Spyro Enter the Dragonfly, because I was able to make water swim- or, uh, air swimming. There okay. we go. There it is. And... Grapple yeah, Beam right grapple there. Beam up there. I think we just- Yep, Woo! go for it. And... Hello, Turn. Dark Torvus! And hoop hoo -yah. Yeah! Three out of three. That's the third key! Oh, that wasn't too bad. No, it wasn't. Kind of like how uh, the uh, the third key is right where we need to be. Did we just, like, dive into the water? And there it is? I, I actually can't remember where it's it was. It's just underneath right here. This yes. white door right here. Yes! We're in! Yes! Good job, King. Now let's go defeat the Dark Temple or whatever. Wait, you said we still have a boss to fight. Of course we do. Uh -oh. oh, you think they're gonna leave their their temples undefended? No. What do you think they are? Luminots? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I, 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 sorry, Yumos, I did not mean that. Yeah, that was I, that was hurtful, I, and mm. I, I didn't really mean any of that. My bad. Uh, not exactly any way we could take that back. I, I forgot you're uh, listening. Sorry. Uh, mm -hmm. You're basically right here inside my helmet. No, I didn't mean to call you a moth. It's 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 it's, uh, it's, it's fine. It's fine. Anyway, boss time. Uh, ooh. Oh, it's filling with bad water. Ew. That can't be good. Oh, we're fighting a giant moth. Well, we, we already saw what the boss looked like. Oh, did we? Yeah. Oh, I must have been asleep. We, 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 we caught a little glimpse of him. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, great. Oh, my God. Yeah, there he is. <gasps> oh. Hey. Uh, um. Uh, it's a cocoon. <laughs> oh, no. Field of dark energy is disrupting deep scanning ability. Unable to scan by. I don't like this. Ex signs of extreme growth present on the structure. Well, we let's go here. ahead and free it. After scanning it, of course. Dark structure designed to support cocoon. Destruction of supports will release cocoon. Okay. Oh, right, so, so dump just, it into uh, the dark water. Got it. Boom. Missile. Missile. I think you can use beam, though, but missile. And missile. And be free! All right, so there's the door. We just got to get through the... Oh. Oh, no. Unleash the beast. It's it's hatched. Oh, boy. An amoeba? What's the opposite of an amoeba? Uh, oh, right. I Something big and watery. Of course, it's a goddamn motherfucking whale! <gasps> Dude! Okay, that's cool. We just hatched a whale. So let's kill a whale. Let's do it. Whale. Okay. Ch chicka. It's a chicka. Chicka. Okay, a larva. Oh dear. A larval chicka. They get bigger. Infant insectoid guardian. 
It's got a soft underbelly and, uh, well, yeah, that's about it. Okay. This part's a little bit arduous. It's also shooting out these dark shredders. They serve as, you know, item pickups if you need it, but they're also annoyances and uh, harassers. Turtle soup. Because they blow up and no. do bad stuff too. You get all the dark water all over you. So uh, there's a couple of ways that you can cheese this. Uh, there's a, it's, it's going through a set pattern. What the, what the chicka does is it dives into the water and then the bubbles show up and it does a dive like that. That's <laughs> your time to shoot it. So you need to be constantly aware. It does it twice. Okay. That's it's hard to tell where neat. the bubbles come from. You gotta make sure you're locked on. Then you get to it. Oh, it's hard to do though. What's its weakness? Light beam, I, I surmise. Uh, there's there, there's a there, there's 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 really so much a weakness right now. It's just kind of what works. Oh, okay. So I do have a little bit of a, a little bit of a strat. You can kind of speed things along if you shoot a certain point. You can kind of get its underbelly when it's swimming around like this. Yeah, I saw you were able to get some hits off. Now. It's it's a little difficult to do, but uh, it just kind of helps things along. Oh this, yeah, this, this, there you go. This part doesn't last too long because you can only hit it so many times, though. Blah. And you can't even lock onto it most of the time because it doesn't feel like locking onto it. So <laughs> time to freeform this. It's got to be a little, Bruce, Bruce. a little bit of improvising. This this mode won't last too long. God, that wave does so much damage. Yeah, that's that's a big killer there. And it also doesn't seem like you're doing too much damage. Is, does he flop onto the onto the platform eventually? Yeah, eventually he'll, he'll flop on, and okay, then good. we can do stupid damage. I like right, stupid. right now he's in his, uh, oh, I'm, I'm, I'm just swimming around. Oh, you you, you are my plaything you know, right now. I am a whale. And then we heard it enough, and he's like, wait a minute, you're a threat. That means I gotta take you down. And then he exposed himself, and then it becomes really easy to kill. Splooge. Right, right now we just gotta get his health down enough so that way he uh, gets into that get up on the platform mode. Get up on that thing and let me shoot up. your belly. Come on. Get up on right. that thing. He gets up like that and get a couple of shots in. Yeah. Ah! That's your <laughs> Hello, would you like to buy- Ah! Da -da -da. And he just- you can't tell where he's coming from, and you can you can try with the the stereo Dolby headphones. There it is, right there. And the locking gun. Not always so easy. Okay, it's okay. a big one, UDJ. Cast your line. We're eating tonight if you can catch that thing. Yeah, big if. Big if. Come on. Come on, you can get this chakra. What was that? A shika. Aha! Now he's on land. <laughs> Hi, my name is. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Do Two not enough like. Times he's like, ah, and then you can just, just go crazy with the dark bean. Oh my god, are you good. gonna do the? Oh, you should have shot a black hole at him. Gotta save it, man. That, you, you've got. Okay, well, it's okay, thirty you got bullets. Me, you got me. You got me. You got thirty me. freaking dark bean bullets. That's only three dark burst shots, and we don't even know if it's gonna hit or not. You, a uh, good point. Well made. I'm a cautious Metroid player. <laughs> uh, Grapple Guardian would like a word with you. No, you say you're a cautious but man. Not, uh, come on. This is obviously where most of our time is going to go today, dedicated to this boss. This seems pretty cut and dry. Unless there's a magical second phase. I mean, it is our, it is an arduous fight, but I'd figured that, you know, the arduous fights are best saved for the Temple Guardians, of course. Them being the big baddies and all. You guys get out of here. Because even though it's taking a long time, even though we're taking a lot of hits, we haven't lost our first E-Tank yet. Yeah, because you're in a constant state of being healed, which is pretty nice. That is nice. Seems like Light Beam was doing a lot of damage. No, oh, well, Dark Beam's doing about the same. See, I don't think there's any real big one weakness that you can do, because you kind of want to save your ammo. It is. Why not go out? Or is something going to happen afterwards? Okay, I, I get your hint, I get your hint, I get your little side eye you're giving me there. Why? Yeah, why is he just called Larva, not just Chica? Spoosh. Like I said, they can get bigger. I mean, he was in a cocoon for all this time. Or maybe Mama shows up. Oh, that'd be something. <laughs> With a, just a giant purse, and it's like, What are you doing to my baby? Smack Samus over the head with her purse. It kind of reminds me of the that one fight in Twilight Princess. 
Ooh. Where you're getting all those like light bugs to mm -hmm. clear all the twilight, and then the very last one that you get for the very last uh, area is a big old boss. Is a big old bug boss like this. <laughs> kill it, kill it, kill it with fire. So eventually he'll just stop doing his uh, jumping around thing and just get on land, or he can get a lot more damage oh, in. Oh, I love it! I love it! Yep, rack up that damage. Eventually he'll just keep doing it. Chewy. And he dives, and he's gonna and come up on land. Come on, and come, on. Up, 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 come on up, come on up! I got something to tell you. It's a funny knock knock joke. Ah. Knock! Not right, not yet, not yet. First D tank lost. Run over. Got it back. <laughs> the run is saved. Ah, I lost it. Ah, never mind. Okay, screw the entire thing. Scrap the recording. Reset. Toss everything. Throw the Wii out the window. Start back at zero mission. Oh, no, the retrospective, why? <laughs> what are we doing here? This is really arduous. Oh, we get to rewind before Metroid Dread came out. Oh, no. I don't want to go back that far. Oh, hi! All right, come on, come What's on. What's up, man? We we figured out your game. It's it's bad. Come on, just, just die already. And then he goes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was supposed to be an enemy in Metroid Prime 1. <laughs> Jeez, come on, you, you, just, just, just die already. Well, all this is still going on. Have you still been enjoying your time with Metroid Prime 2? Oh, uh, uh, God, yes, of course. Okay, good. Oh, hello. So, let's try Light Beam. It's not doing that, as, See, it's not doing as much either. I don't know, it still looks like a lot. But as much as the Dark Beam. Hey! There we go. Got him! Oh. Alright. My mother will hear about this, let... Except, of course it's not over. Why would it be? Now the arena has been split into three and there's grapple points everywhere. <laughs> because right. now it has evolved. How did it evolve so quickly? It's Ing. What do you expect? Uh oh. That's what he's supposed to look like! It goes from a whale to a fly? That's an adult chicka! What?! That's another scan you need. Ew! Ah! Did I not scan it? Hey. Uh, okay, I was about to say it. Don't, don't <laughs> fucking don't, tell me! Don't, don't tell, me. tell me! Don't do it! Get, get it! Get it! There, there we go! Alright. Chicka, adult chicka. It's a flying insectoid guardian. Dark energy especially. A whale. <laughs> okay, so here's how you spank him. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, sh show me, oh master. It says it's weak to dark energy, but dark energy, the, the dark beam's kind of slow. Power beam works fine because you're not really doing damage like this. Right. So, so just fire a whole bunch of stuff at him, and then, uh, well, eventually, you know, once he uh, stops shooting shit at me, he'll do that and he'll get weak. Do that, and you grab a beam over here. Whoop, wrong button. Get your seeker missile ready. Aim at oh. those four spots on the back and let her fly, and that's how you do damage. That is so much faster. I thought we were going to be stuck in this hell for quite a bit. Nope, this one's a little bit easier. Thank the Lord. I got, oh my God. I got some nice strats on him, too. Oh, excellent, excellent. Like, like I said, it says dark energy, but trust me, the power beam is much more accurate, and it's going to do just as much. Ah. Yeah, I got, I got, I got. <laughs> You Don't. can use the, the Dark Beam when he's weak like that, but I find Seeker Missiles are better because it takes out all that stuff in one shot. Seeker Missiles are the best. Make sure that you look where he's facing, otherwise you're going to go in the wrong area. Oh no! So, that's a bust. Oops. Shit. <laughs> and of course, it runs out of time by the time I get over here and... Uh, oh yeah. god! Can you add a plink sound effect when those missiles go in? Yeah, a lot of Samus' weapons have a plink effect to them. I noticed, yeah! Yeah, see, I see, see dark, dark beam's dark not working so much. Way too slow for not this. Not working too good. Power beam works just as good. You're still not doing damage either way. Only when it's weak in the back can you do that. So this means you probably have to do like two swings over now. That just depends. You, you, you got to look where he's facing. He's always facing towards uh, one of the platforms. I think I just went the wrong way. Is what happened. Do that. Charge oh, up. Okay. Beep 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 and <laughs> bang. <laughs> what? And then he falls. Oh. Oh, ow, that ow, is ow. awful. Ow. Oh man! Seriously? Wait, he fell in the water. That can't be good. He's losing health. Oh, it looked like it. Cause now he's a dark chicka. 
What? Okay. He's been charged by the dark energy of the water, so he's a dark chicken now. His uh, tactics have changed a little bit. Now he's just weak all the time. Get out your light beam and fire that thing! Oh. Mm. Yes. Oh, he's, it's so weak, he's, it's disgusting. Oh, man, he, mm. ch he charged it up, it's really good too, then he spits out these things. These chicklings. are chicklings. Oh, God, he's spitting out an entire swarm of bees at me! What am I gonna do? It's not like that these are... It's collectibles I can shoot and get all my beam energy back. Ah, design. Excellent. Anyway, I'm just gonna, uh, partake getting in some chicklings. Getting my health back, getting my yeah. missiles back. Oops, you didn't really Oops. think about this too hard, did you? Charge, charge light beam works really good. That's basically five oh shots right God. there. Go. Oh, oh man. Uh, okay. Should have stayed as a baby. <laughs> Stupid baby. Growing up and all that. Pfft. Oh, wow. Yeah, he's... Yeah, it said most of its body wasn't... Oh, now it's it's it's, it's back. back to being regular. Okay. So it's gonna go... It's uh, gonna alternate between light and dark now every couple of... Oh, uh, uh, really? That That's just a time waster. A little bit, but okay. if you know how to spank him, it's all good. Still doing damage, which is okay. Don't worry, still spanking, still spanking. Stop slap. yanking, we're spanking. Slap, slap. slap. <laughs> oh, <my> oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right, he's got some moves of his own. That's fine. Came in for a giant kiss. Hello. Mwah. Can you stay put, please? Oh, there we go. All right, over there. Facing right over there. The secret missile already. Beep, beep, please, beep, 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 and split. Plume. Whoa, there you go. Now fall into the water, please, and become very vulnerable. Let me just get that, uh, get that light beam ready. <laughs> Charge it up. All right, ready for you. Come on. And... Die. Yeah, oh, I mean, oh. uh, die. Die, yeah, yeah, there we go. There we go, there we go. Oh, charge light beam is definitely best. Holy God. Yeah, it's it's over. Yeah. I, I think ow, it's ow, over. Ow, 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 okay, ow, fine, ow. fine. Okay, all right. I deserve that. I'm sorry. No, you're not. Yeah, it's. I'm not it's, sorry for this though. Well, I guess uh, hold I on, you get a little bit of beam energy back before uh, we get back to the regular game. <laughs> Are you this won't take too much longer. Mercy? Uh. I'm, I'm, I'm delaying the inevitable because mm -hmm. just one more charge shot ought to do it. There you go. Oh, finally. And and that and that is it. That that is it. Okay, I think I'll give that'll probably be my one nitpick for Metroid Prime 2 is the bosses take for freaking ever to die. I didn't like that first phase. This phase was fun. I like this. That first one went out a little too long. There were more ways to like at least, you know, get him into that get on the what's that? A light suit? A light suit. Light suit. Or maybe a suit to let us go into the dark water. Huh. That'd be pretty neat. Come on, a suit of pure gold! Have it be- ah, My eyes! Oh, oh, that's cause it's a visor! It, oh. It's the dark visor! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Can we see the darkness in people's hearts? It's essentially the same as an x-ray laser. Or x-ray visor, I suppose. Ew. Okay, well... It's not- it's not too bad, though. It's- it's a lot better than it was in Metroid Prime 1, like a lot of things are. You turn it on, and everything that is invisible turns a nice bright red. That is actually a lot better. And what's also nice is that it doesn't have Lens of Truth uh, values. You see how it's black and white until it gets in that visor and it turns bright red? So you can still see it, even though in actuality we're kind of standing on nothing. Oh. So I like the dark visor. It's a very contextual thing, of course, but it works. I have to ask one thing. Uh-huh. Even if you don't have the visor equipped, can you still land on invisible platforms? You probably could, but this wouldn't activate until you get the dark visor, so, hmm. This oh. game has gone through great lengths to try and make sure you do not sequence break. And yet... Oh, well, you, st you still Every can, everyone but has they, found but ways they to tried harder. Break. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know, in Metroid Prime 1, uh, you you could get some of the Chozo artifacts early? Yeah, 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 Well, there's a similar system here in Prime 2, and you gotta wait until you clear all three temples first before you do that. Can't get any otherwise. Time to steal the power of the sun. There, there. <laughs> <laughs> this is only gonna hurt a second! <laughs> Oh, 
power of the sun in the palm of my hand. I gotta say, this feels really cool, though, to be stealing their energy a second time. Ho, 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 ho. First time was a fluke. Second time was skill. Oh, yeah, skills. Here we go. See, first time it's like, oh, someone named uh, Samus Aaron is uh, attacking our base. Well, she'll probably fall like the rest of these Federation fools. Ha ha. And then we take it and it's like, oh, she must be a threat. All right, make sure that you take her down. And then we just destroyed her. What are they going to do now? What are they going to do now? Hmm. We took two thirds of their energy. We've turned the war into the Luminoth's favor. What are they going to do now? I'll probably recruit Dark Samus or something like that. They're, she's already part of it. <laughs> well, no. She showed up and laughed at us. And, well, who's laughing now? Uh, on her throne of skulls, she goes, Bring me the head of the one that looks like me. Is it, whoa. whoa, whoa, whoa. Hello. I mean, uh, Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, full damage. Blah. Oh, right. There's a quick way to get back to the Luminoths, isn't there? Well, yeah, I mean, we gotta put the energy in the temple first, and... That's well, that, that's what I meant, a quicker way back to their <sighs> temple. I'm kicking myself. I could've, I could've saved right here, but I'm like, no, it has to lead up to something. I went through two tough bosses, I wanna, I wanna change this energy over, but I could save right now, and it would be a good, decently sized episode, and the next one's a little shorter than normal, just... I, I, I messed, I messed it all up. I'm so sorry. The scheduling is all wrong. My dude. I'm so sorry. My dude. I'm so I will flay myself in front of you right now. But why would you? The only person who cares about that is yourself. And I condemn myself for crimes against humanity. <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. Stupid. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I didn't plan this out correctly. <laughs> now what? I got too, I got too greedy. Now what have we learned, Mr. YouTuber person? <laughs> Episodes can be whatever length they will. Oh, <laughs> 30 minutes, I'm sorry. Brevity is the soul of wit. And the algorithm just keeps stepping oh, on your face. Oh, get out of yep, here, guys. Here they are, I knew it. No, I knew it. no, 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 no. Get out of here! Are you gonna fucking die? Get and out! Ha and have to redo Am all of that. I almost got trapped there. Ow! Get me out of here! Jeez! Whew! Sick of these guys! Sick of their shit! Sick of their crap! Sick of it! I was waiting for the death, the resignation, and then, okay, next time on Metroid Prime 2, we're actually gonna do what I set out to do. No, there's no nothing like that. We're, we're fine, we're gonna do the thing. Imagine having to go all the way back and having to fight that three-stage boss fight AGAIN! Could probably do it faster. Probably save better. I thought about doing this episode <laughs> over like three times already. <laughs> well, too late now, I guess. It's, Here we are doing it. It's fine, my friend. No, it's, it isn't. It's, it's not fine. <laughs> I'm gonna show you how to smack this guy, though. Try to activate him. Get up here. Yeah, come on. Yeah, yeah, come yeah, on. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Oh, fine. Okay, fine. I'll I'll go through the maze. Here we go. <laughs> yeah, guess what? Hey, uh is, Oh hey, is that hey, Okay, then then you wake up. Hey, what's up? Yeah, there you, yeah, you motherfucking hey, yeah, hey, Zubendorf, you wanna lick my ball so badly? There you go. Mission accomplished. I forget Sh what that thing is called. Splorb. Spl <laughs> it's a splorb. <laughs> that still sounds made up. That sounds like Federation naming. <laughs> that's it. Sounds like a Mario naming convention. It's like, oh, look out, the Splorbs are here. Oh, you can tell it's a Terran word. <laughs> oh, shit, we're Terrans. Oops. <laughs> well, we're, we're, we're like little monkey brains compared to the big uh, brains of the moth people. I can just imagine the, the Federation's laughing at that joke. It's like, <laughs> yeah, those Terrans. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> I've been telling this joke for two years. <laughs> hey, wait, I just got it. Oh, the Federation always being slow on the uptake when it comes to personal burns. Are we there yet? Almost. Are we there yet? I could, I could have saved and we could have done all this, but it Are had to mean yet? something! All this had to mean something, and all had to, had to lead yet? up to something! Are we there yet? Are we there You did yet? Are we there yet? Dude, I'm trying, dude, but the game dude, won't dude, load! It has dude, a lot to load dude, here! Are you there yet? <laughs> Almost! Are there yet? Almost! Don't make me turn this episode around. Well, and go backwards all 39 minutes? <laughs> Let's go, man! No! Double leg! <laughs> Hour and 30 minute episode of Metroid Prime 2, incoming. Well, I mean, this was kind of an important one. 
we're kind of crossing the threshold from when I stopped playing casually, and now we're getting into... If you beat two bosses and finished the entirety of Torvis, like, I, I like, think it's okay. Like, I, I, I think we're getting to the point where I stopped playing, because there's one boss coming up that seems familiar to me. I don't know if I ever beat it or not. Don't but, you love those false memories? Yeah. Of thinking, wait a minute, I recognize that, but did I... Because there was, there was, you know, when I first started playing this, you know, when it came out and I and I played it, you know, that playthrough, then I put in the action replay and then continue with that a little bit, that playthrough, but I never finished it. I, I, I don't know. Well, that doesn't matter. What matters is this playthrough right here. Because this, this is the one that matters. And uh, I think this one just shows that the Luminoth now have two thirds of their power back. And the Aang are now running at 33% right now. You know what that means, right? They're pissed! Time to fight back. Oh, now that now they are... You see her, you kill on sight! Time to snipe her head off, yeah, yeah, yeah. I am so glad they don't have a midway plot point of, hey, we stole the energy back. God, that would oh, suck. Oh, yeah, that would be terrible. I mean, unless if that leads up to the final bit, though. Like, you know, we get all six Dragon Balls, and we get the seventh one, and then, oh, that's when Emperor Pilaf comes in and steals them. <laughs> now we gotta go, we go up to his palace now, and, and final take boss. take them all back, yeah. You know, that's just, that's just narrative structure compared to it just being, oh, let's take about two hours and take care of this for a second. <sighs> Thanks, Last of Us 2. Oh, God, really? <laughs> that, see, I, 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 I have no interest in Last of Us. Uh, based on reviews, it goes on for way too fucking long. Well, of course it does. I didn't even beat the first one. I got to, like, fall, and I'm like, all right, I think this isn't going to get any better. Hello. Thank you. I'm having a heart attack. We have avenged him. Transfer's complete. Torvus <sighs> is restored. One more to go. No more bog, baby. No more bog, unless we got to come back here for backtracking, which we do. No more racing polar bears. Damn boggy. Uh, oh, uh, yeah, I, I hold on, so. hold on. Uh, uh, there we go. That I was did. my stretch for the episode. I'm about to say, I bet Samus could get the crap out of Bucky and his sled because she's got the boost <laughs> ball and all that. Duh. She can shine spark. <laughs> oh shit! I forgot it. that shine spark was the thing. Are we getting that in this game? Uh, not in this game, no. This isn't really a Shine Spark. Damn or, it! Like, can you imagine Shine Spark in this game? Are you, are you kidding me? No way! No way! <laughs> It'd be kind of funny. Though you would be surprised about what this game actually does have. Hmm. The Dark Visor, for one, I mean. No, I mean, that's, that's brand new. It's a new item. Oh, yeah. They just called it something different instead of the X-ray visor. All right, let's head to a safe point. Hi. Damn it! All right, this time we actually are equipped. Oh, we got the dark shit. visor. That's we can, awesome. We can see him now. Doesn't make it any easier though, because they're still like, ha, huh, nope. They still take way too much goddamn light beam ammo. Ha, nope. Look at this. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> Die already. What's wrong with you? It's light beam energy. You should be dying already. There. They Why does it take so long? They can't be shot by missiles. Probably, but, you know, light beam ammo, it's a dark trooper, so figure that it would work. Oh, well, you're thinking light versus dark. I'm saying throw supernovas at them. Black holes all the way. Though hitting with the light beam enough times is pretty good, because, you know, they start to be on that white fire, that white light fire. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can track them a little bit that way. But I'm, t I'm, I'm done. This episode's gone on way too God, long. Da, da, da. <laughs> because, of, because of my poor planning and my absolute amateurish ability. Hey, and, and, I, and, and really long, arduous boss I, phases. I'm going, to, I'm going to do you a favor. One LP or two and another. Ah, quiet! <laughs> Enjoy the episode, damn it! Enjoy well, the it's game. over now! Enjoy the game you're playing! I am enjoying the game, and, you know, it's, 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 they would have tweaked that, that first phase a bit longer. And a bit more, it would have been fine. If but anything, you are hearkening back to the something awful days where some episodes were over an hour. Well, as long as they hit a certain beat. We're not there yet, but I think we've hit <laughs> enough beats. Next time on Metroid Prime 2, we're going to be exploring the final area. Woo! See you next time.